All right, guys, welcome to a Friday phone tips. I got Paul McLean here in the office in Carlsbad. And if there's anybody who's been banging the phones out, knows what to say, what not to say, and just learned a lot over the years, man, it's my man Paul. So he's going to give us a tip. I know he has a million of them, but here's one quick one. All yours, Paul. Awesome, man. Well, hey, the, the tip I'd give you guys is to execute like pattern interrupt. When somebody um, is giving you an objection or what have you, first of all, I think you got to see it the right way. I didn't see it as an objection. I, I saw it as they needed clarification. Because objection is almost like you're putting something before you that you got to overcome. To me, it was just like they're uneducated. I'm just going to clarify it. But there's no question in my mind that they need this appointment because they need the life insurance because they sent in a form. So the story I told myself to what I believed about this lead and the client was already going to line me up with success, which is that they sent in the form. They need the help. So anytime they gave me an objection, I didn't see it as an objection. It was just I need to, I need to clarify. How did I do that? So I'd say, hey, great, great question, Dom. Um, my purpose of my call is just to see what you qualify for at the best price possible. Now, as far as getting the information that you want for your family, I could get you squeezed in between appointments at four or seven. So that's just that pattern interrupt. So always ask a question. The person that asks the most questions win. I remember not remembering what to say when I got objections. And I remembered though, to ask a question. And I had a client one time, give me an objection. Can I get a quote? I say, that's a great question, Dom. The purpose of my call is to see what you qualify for at the best price possible. Hey, what color is your car? They, they, they answered. They said, it's blue. I said, perfect. I got a four or seven. I'm not kidding. Honest to God, I booked the appointment. If you ask questions, you'll be in control. So remember, you're supposed to be in control because you're the doctor and they're the patient. So that'd be the tip I got. <laughs>